Hello friends, Lord Verminard, back again in the long drive. It's been a couple of days. Uh, look at this, I found this barrel of diesel here. I must have left that last time. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, it's been, it's been a while. Uh, I apologize for uh, not having any videos over the weekend. But, you know, it was Mother's Day weekend, and I was doing Mother's Day things. I had a uh, pretty substantial honeydew list um, of just getting our garden and everything ready to go. That's what my wife really wanted to get done, so we got it done. A lot of work. A lot of work. Don't particularly love gardening. Um, but, you know, I'll, I'll do it for the wifey. She wants it, so we're going to get it done. And that's what I did. <clears throat> Thankfully, not too sore either. It was a lot of work. We needed to do basically everything. We need to get all the beds ready and put up fences for the chickens and set up like a like a trellis awning thing. And we planted everything. And yeah, it was a whole bunch of work, but we got it done. All right. I don't know what kind of things we're going to get into today, but I am anxious to get started. Oh, this is empty now. All right, go away. Oop. Close this. Perfect. Okay, that's closed. We got spray. We got uh, an autosave. We have completely full tank. I love this, man. A completely full tank of fuel. Uh, How far are we going here? Okay, so 303... And we're off. Oh, God. And we have a, uh, a supercharged, turbocharged diesel. I just remembered that. <laughs> Woo! Okay. She's spicy. <laughs> ah, this is fantastic. Yes. Yes, this truck is uh, way faster than it should be. Oh boy. So how's everybody doing? How was your weekend? How are things? Hope that everything is doing well. Busy time of year for me. Uh, you've got the, you know, the kids got soccer practices during the week and then games on the weekends and I've got bike nights and stuff and we've got all the yard work going on and it seems like we've got activities almost every single day. So, just gotta roll with it, I guess. Yeah, this thing is freaking hauling. It's maintaining 200 easy. Which, I would say, in this game, for most of the vehicles, 200 kilometers an hour is just about as fast as you really want to go. Things start getting... Things start getting pretty weird after <laughs> much faster than that. And depending on the vehicle you have, it could be... It could be horrible. So yeah, I'm, I want to throw this out there. I uh, haven't committed to it 100%. But I am taking this coming Wednesday, which I guess is the... Oh god, there's a stop. Which is a... What day would that be? I guess the 15th? Which would be the day after this video, right? Uh, I'm taking that day off of work for a kid's function. A thing for my, that my kid is doing. But it won't take us the whole day. So I'm contemplating if I have enough time in the afternoon um, trying to do maybe a stream. You know, not for very long. Just a couple hours or whatever. Uh... Oh, it's one of these places again. Okay. Let's get this beast turned around here. I heard a rabbit. You know what? I'm just going to sleep. I don't think there's anybody in there right now, so... So, yeah. Uh, if you guys are interested, um, potentially, I might be streaming this coming Wednesday, the 15th, in the afternoon. It would probably be... Uh, maybe around 3 o'clock... Eastern time, something like that. I don't really know. 
I'll, I'll, I'll put a post up once I have any kind of confirmation about that. Right now, I, you know, like I said, it's just kind of a maybe. So, anyways, um, pencil that in your schedules if you are interested in catching me during a stream. It'll be my first one, so go easy on me. Gaity. Uh, let's see, we got oil, gas, a music box, which is a little bit strange. And in here we have, whoop! Nothing. Nothing in here. Nothing at all. There's diesel. I'm not even going to bother. There's a there's a random sausage on... I don't even know what, I, what these things are. Or what they're supposed to be. I don't know. Alright, nothing here. Let's go. Yep. Good lord, this thing accelerates fast. Okay. <laughs> All right, moving on. Yeah, there's still there's still a handful of new buildings that I haven't seen from this mod yet, so I'm keeping my eyes peeled. I am definitely enjoying what I've seen so far, though. It's been a really good time. And the supercharger mod. Oh my god, like, how cool is that? <laughs> also, and also, what the hell is that? Uh, let's get on them brakes here. Oh, that's the that's the junkyard. I don't think I really need anything in there right now. As cool as the junkyard is. There's also something else over there. What is that? Oh god. Freaking rabbit. Oh, I'm losing fluids. I'm losing fluids. Is that fuel? Is that fuel that I was losing? What the freaking hell? Alright. Okay, that's closed. What the hell? What what was leaking out? God, how to save really right now? Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Did I have one of these open? Yep. I did. Look at there. Alright, well, we fixed it. Okay. Anyways, what did I lose? I lost some parts. I lost a mirror. Damn it! And it's in the freaking grassland, so I'm never gonna find it. <sighs> Stupid rabbits just appearing out of thin air. I hate that. I hate when that happens. I hate when killer rabbits appear out of thin air in front of me. Um. Let's back this hog up here real quick. I'm going to cheat and use the uh, use the grass loading in thing to kind of gain a bit of an unfair advantage. But I do not see my mirror anywhere. I actually don't even know if it was on there. It could have I could have lost that a long time ago and I didn't even know about it. Well, whatever. I guess we'll just have to find another one. Meanwhile, I want to investigate what this building is over there. We're going off-road. Actually, I need to be careful because the stupid grass is hard to see the rocks. Oh, that's just a regular... It's just a regular old water tower. That's nothing nothing interesting. Alright, back to the road. Uh, 
All right. Yeah, there's another one over there. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, man, this thing is just screaming. Oh, yeah, another thing I've been doing, I've, I forgot to mention, I've taken on a couple of side jobs, too. That's usually something I do every year, depending on how much money I'm in need for. <laughs> but, I mean, that's usually how I pay for all of my, like, projects and stuff. Like, whenever I'm working on a car or building a bike or something like that, I usually pay for it with just all the money I make from side work. Um... Because I don't really have any extra income with my job. So, um, so yeah. So right now I've got a, I've got a Vespa scooter that I'm fixing for somebody. Um, I've got, ooh, what the hell is this? All the brakes. All the brakes. Uh, yeah, boy, we got this sucker stopped that time, didn't we? Yeah, she's still winding down. Okay. <laughs> what happens when you go from fifth gear at 200 kilometers an hour to first gear? What the hell is this thing? This is, uh... This is interesting. Some kind of... Communications thing with a weird bendy antenna? Hello? Anybody to hear? Um... Okay, this is this is neat. What's this? Oh, it's a headlight. Well, I can use it to break things. Cones. I don't need any of those. Uh, what's in here? Uh, there's a gun. This is a fuel tank. It looks like. Full of water. Hey, I'll drink some. I always trust water that I find in random containers. Seems smart. What's up here? Ooh, is this the <laughs> is this the mirror that I need? No, I think it's the other side, isn't it? Damn it, that would be really that would have been hilarious. That was the right one. It's not. Oh, there's there's gauges up here. And a headlight. And a sponge. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's see what's in the building here. I'm not exactly sure what this thing is supposed to be. Some kind of little communication. Hey, there's a duster in here. I haven't seen one of those in a long time. There, There is a use for these. I just can't remember exactly what it is. Oh, wow. Check this out. Old radio equipment or something. I don't know how any of this crap works. There's a bunch of oil. An empty fridge. Okay, well. And a flush water. How about you? <laughs> uh, that's fun. Okay. Well, that was neat. Not particularly anything super interesting there, but... Oh, wait. No, I do need the one for that side. So that mirror would work. Wait, hold on. Hold on. We're gonna go get it. I thought it was the... I thought it was the right side one that I was losing. Losing? Lost? Missing? Yes, that's the right word. Can't word today. Uh... Yes. Well, that's fortunate. What the hell will happen? Oh my god! Okay. Oh, jeez. Scared me so much, I took my glasses off. Alright. <laughs> Where'd that mirror go? Well, there you are. Can I knock you out? Okay, why isn't this working? Pick it up, dude. Just pick it up. What is this, my garage? I, I saw the... There it is. That's the right one, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. Well, that's fortunate. So we did find something exciting here. We got a new mirror. Now I gotta adjust it. And... Uh... Oh, man, this one's all way out of whack. Well, I can't have that here. I 
I have no idea where it's going to have to be, so you have to guess. No, that's not what I wanted to do. That's pretty good. That's that's good enough. All right. Moving on. We we'll started in third gear because it can. Ugh. All right. Cool. Well, we saw something new today. That's awesome. All right. So what the hell was I talking about? Oh, side jobs. Yes, that's right. <laughs> so I, I've got a Vespa that somebody wants me to fix. And uh, I have a set of carburetors from an old XS, um, XS400 Yamaha that somebody in our vintage motorcycle group needs me to rebuild, so I'm doing that. One of my other friends is bringing a, a Honda Shadow uh, VX1100, something like that, over that they need me to rebuild the carburetor on. So I've got work, and I'm one of my friends that has a Volkswagen Tiguan needs me to do some work for it, too, so... So yeah, I'm plenty busy with side work as well, so I gotta try to fit all that in. Good times, good times. Yeah, I'm digging this big old truck. I, I'm sure I'll swap it out at some point, but... I am, I'm enjoying it right now, especially since I have basically unlimited fuel. Not, not necessarily unlimited, but to have a completely full fuel tank and then several barrels of diesel in the back as well is pretty nice. Oh yeah, um, did anybody see the the uh, Auroras anywhere? I didn't, <laughs> unfortunately. Uh, I really wanted to. Um, my wife and I had the idea that we were gonna just jump in the car and drive out of drive north out of the city for a while, so the lights weren't so bad, and. We were driving when when they were most visible, and I think I could actually kind of see them a little bit while I was driving, but since I was driving, uh, there were, you know, cars directly behind me, and so I had headlights basically in my rearview mirrors the whole time, so it was really hard for me to see anything, and there was no place to safely pull over. And by the time we got to a place where we could pull over, most of the viewing for them had was gone, so we missed it. And then so we see all these pictures of my friends who stayed in the city and could see them just fine from their house. So we should have just stayed home and we would have been able to see them just fine. But that's okay. I mean, and I set an alarm for the next night, the following night to see and didn't really see anything. So that's okay. I'll just have to catch them some other time or take a trip to Norway or something and see them there. <laughs> I've actually never been, I've never been overseas. I've only ever been to Canada, which is pretty boring. Um, it's not by choice, it's by necessity, I guess. And traveling costs a lot of money, don't have a lot, so yeah. And also my wife has a lot of trouble traveling. She gets very, very, very motion sick. So flying, driving, any of that stuff is not good. Which is crazy, because she was in the Air Force when she was younger, but, you know, when you're younger, things are different. <laughs> when I was younger, I could drink like eight beers a night and feel fine the next day. I cannot drink that, do that now, not even, not even a little. There's a little gas station, I'm skipping that. Those are boring. Oh my god, the freaking invisible rabbits. Well, I take pleasure in the fact that I completely freaking starched him. But, it looks like I broke some stuff. Uh, lost a headlight, lost my freaking mirror again. I think they're both right here on the road, though. Man, the, the teleporting rabbits are really getting me today.
Oh well, this is a good place to take a sleep anyways. And I'm just happy that I found all my stuff. And it didn't knock the wheels off or any other crazy thing. I can never find the plate. Okay, there you go. Right. Okay, radiator good? Yep. Okay. I think while well, I'm... Oh, God. Knocked everything out of the freaking inside of the car. Okay. Uh, are you there? Yes, you were there. This one's missing, apparently. Uh, we need oil, so... I have some riding shotgun with me here. Alright, this cover goes... Right there. Uh, and we'll just sleep on the passenger side tonight, why not? Man, sleeping in cars sucks. I'm too old for that too. Speaking of things I'm too old for. I used to do that when I was younger, but it's not so easy to do now. Man, I think about all the places I used to sleep when I was a kid. Well, kid, relatively speaking. Whoops, that's the wrong wrong hole. Here we go. So I am missing I'm missing that other gauge. Damn it. I can't believe the rabbit knocked all of my gauges loose. All right, let's let's clean this up here real quick. Oh wait, is that it? Ah, look at that! My basket caught it. <laughs> All right. Or no, is this that other gauge that I've got? Oh yeah, that's that other that's that other tachometer. Okay. That would have been that would have been pretty crazy actually if if my gauge ended up back in there. Okay, go in there. There we go. Take this. Whoop. Okay, now, where did my gauge go? Uh, auto save. Yes, I can remember. That's not a gauge right there, is it? Uh. I don't think so. I don't know what the hell that is, though. Where'd my gauge go? Man. That totally sucks. It's hard to find stuff when it, when it goes wrong in this truck, because... Because it's so high up. Oh god, that scared me. Okay. Maybe it'll, um... Maybe it'll show up again, like like it did that last time. But I, I don't see it on the road anywhere. <sighs> okay, well... Guess it's just the way things are. I don't see it over here either. Damn it. Alright. Let's go. It's raining. I'm just gonna be missing a gauge. Which makes me sad. I sure don't see it laying on the ground anywhere. I don't. Alright. Oh god, can't see. It's funny in this game how parts just go missing. <laughs> where it's like, I had all of the parts, and now they're gone. Now some of them are gone, and I don't know where they went. And it's yes, I've crashed a couple of times, but I feel like I've always gotten everything back. But this time, I clearly could not find that gauge or the sun visor. But I don't know how long they've been missing. So 
You know, I thought they were all there. Ah, oh, crap. I, that rock was completely invisible until I was right on it. All right, all right. And somehow, I didn't lose anything that time. Okay, well, I'm alive. We are having some issues today. <laughs> it wouldn't be a normal wouldn't be a normal long drive video without issues though. Moving on. Yeah, see this truck sits up high, but it's not it's not high enough to get over the biggest rocks, unfortunately. Any of the other ones it can usually straddle pretty easily, but you can't you can't like bang your wheel on it because that'll that'll cause problems. I'm not sure how that didn't injure me though. I mean, I was pretty much going like full chat. <laughs> Oh goody, one of my chickens is yelling. Right on cue. Uh, idiot birds. Okay, here's a house. Some place we can stop and regroup. Maybe we can find... Maybe we can magically find some of the parts we're missing. I think the this truck takes just the regular sun visors that everything else takes, right? Alright, let's slow this beast down a little bit. There's a bad guy in here. I hear him. Uh, shovel, gun. You know what? I'm running low on bullets, so let's just use the shovel. Uh. Where'd you go? There you are. Huzzah! Wow, I didn't kill him the first hit. Okay. That's fine. We got him. What do you got in here? <laughs> There's food. I need that. There's an engine in there. Uh, okay. Ugh. Damn it, I need something to throw at that. Uh, okay, this will work. <laughs> what the hell is that? Oh, it's more of the little, uh, Minecraft figures things. Do I... Do I still have mine? I don't think I do, do I? Well, crap, now we do. Here. You... Go right there. Perfect. That's better. Uh, no, that's not... Pick this up, get it over there, put this there. Okay. Do I see my gauge anywhere? Did it, like... Did I shake it free of whatever crevice it was jammed in? Yeah, I think it's gone. Ugh, that bites. That bites and sucks. Let's see, what else is here? Anything I can use? There is not much of anything here. Uh... Spray? I guess I could... Will we use some of that? I don't really need it. Yeah, there's nothing here. Nothing. Alright, here. We will take this and... Reload that. Drop. Grab. Throw. 17 here. 
six here. How many? I can't remember how many how many shots they hold. Is it twenty four? Uh, no, twenty. Okay, well, now we know. You get in there. You. Go in there. All right. And let's roll. All right. We don't need wipers anymore. Whoops. Go this way. Moving on. We are almost done with our 50Ks. Yes. Well, we didn't find the missing pieces of this of this truck, and I honestly finding another truck like this with working gauges is gonna be probably difficult because you don't come by these trucks very often. But that's okay. If we find it, we find it. If not, whatever. I always forget what actual gauge it is that's missing in that corner of slot over there. There's a big building down there, but I don't know what it is. Looks like it's a little far away. I think we'll skip it for now. So we're coming up to something up here, which I I do not recognize. What the hell is that? Oh, that's one of those big satellite dish things. I want to check that out because I don't think I've seen one of those up close yet. Okay. Damn, that thing's huge. Are there any hostels? I don't see any. Looks like there's a mine down there, too. Oh, wow. Check this thing out. Is there any way up there? Probably not, huh? That reminds me, I need to keep, I need to find a broom and throw it in the back of the truck, just for occasions such as this, where I want to get up there, but I can't. And I could probably try and glitch jump my way up there somehow using the truck, but that is a pretty dangerous affair. Huh. Pretty neat. I doubt there's anything up there I can do anything with, but... But it looks cool. All right, well. Yep, and then I think that's the mine down there. Oh, no, that's a... Whoa! That's a plane! Let's do it. Yes, I remember somebody mentioning the plane. Let's take a look. Oh, how cool is this? Wow, check this out. What kind of crap am I going to find in here? Wow. 
This is neat. All right. Let's have a peek. Are there any people in here? Hello? Yeah, this is kind of scary. I'm not gonna lie. Uh... I feel like I'm hearing something, but I can't... see anything. Oh, there's skeletons. There's oh, <laughs> is this a uh, an airplane reference? The movie Airplane. Anybody see that? Of course, people have seen that. Who hasn't seen that? For God's sakes. Um. Okay. Okay. All right. It's getting dark. I would like to make sure this place is completely empty before I decide to sleep in it. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to sleep in it. I don't want any rabbits attacking me. So, oh, look at all the luggage. Yeah, I can pick him up. What's up there, bud? Um, okay, let me go sleep. And then I'll uh, rummage through here and see what I can find. This is cool. Oh, God. No. No. Ah. Seems to happen to me all the time. I try to get into the seat and he freaking unlocks the stupid freaking stupid thing. <laughs> Emergency break. What's the word I'm looking for? Why is that thing moving? Hmm. Okay. Let us investigate. Anything in here? I'm guessing those are probably all empty. Ooh. Airplane food is ass. <laughs> uh, oh, there's all kinds of food in here. Dang. And we're auto saving. Auto saving hard. Uh, yep, 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 yep. Oh, another dead guy. What up, friend? All right, uh, cargo, okay. Yeah, this is really neat. Uh, I didn't know there'd be this much food on here. That's kind of cool. Twofer. All right. Cool. All right. Well, there's nothing, nothing I need in here. This is awesome. This is really cool. I think this is a, especially, especially this is very fitting for the overall kind of feeling of the game, right? Because there's still planes flying around, but you would think that whatever it is that caused all this problems, they'd probably cause a lot of planes just to drop out of the sky, you know? All right. I approve. That was very cool. All right. Where the hell's the road at? Uh, right in front of me. All right. <clears throat> I love looking at new stuff. <laughs> Whoa, couldn't make that turn. So there's a windmill over there. Um, I've seen a couple of those before. I don't think there's anything to do with them. They're just there. Just to add some variety to the landscape, which is cool. I 
I I actually wouldn't be surprised if the developer decided to add the uh, the different locations from this mod into the game. He's done that before, like with the, somebody made the Icarus bus um, as a mod first before it was put into the game. So, and I think there's some other examples of that too. So I wouldn't be surprised to see that be in the game, and I'm totally okay with it because I think it's. I think it's pretty awesome. Let's see, there's another big building over there. Way off in the distance. I can't tell what it is, though. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's just... Uh, Desert landscape. Cool, now my chicken's yelling closer to the window, so that's fun. Apologize if anybody can hear that. I've mentioned this before, this is the loudest batch of chickens I have ever had. God, that was a very long stutter. Oh god. I said it a little too hard. Okay. <laughs> Come on, go, go, go. Yeah, the, the manual transmission is so weird in this game. All right, now chances are there's probably going to be somebody in here because there has been every single time so far. Shovels at the ready. There's nobody in here. Okay. Let's go ahead and open the rear doors. Um, let's dig up this crate, too. Why not? Ta -da. And there's nothing in there. Yay! Okay. We've got here a Wartburg. With an engine. At least there's that. That's cool. Uh, we got some gas in there. A brush. Another brush. Um, a gauge. Nothing too exciting in here. All right. Go. Oh, yeah. I wanted to hop up on the roof here and see if I could see anything. No, nah, can't see anything. Yeah, see, that was that one big building that I couldn't tell what it was. That might be that bus depot. I'm not really sure. Maybe we'll see it again. All right. All right, we're actually up on our kilometers here, but I'm just gonna keep going. Maybe do one more stop. No more rabbits. Ugh. <laughs> Did you see that one? <laughs> I'm glad that it didn't freaking destroy my car, but instead I sent the rabbit into the next universe. That uh, that makes me happy. All right, I'm glad the game gave me gave me that one. All right, humming right along here. Let's see what we can find and see if we can find a good place to stop. Whoop, missed that one. There's another one. Dodge them rocks. What is that? No, oh, this rocks. Okay. I still think it would be cool too to have like stuff on top of some of these like big, big rock features. I've messed around and gone up on several of them and I've never seen anything. So, as far as I know right now, there isn't anything on them. 
but it'd be cool in the future if something dang what the hell are these rocks it would be cool if there was something there all right better slow down this is kind of a tight turn that <laughs> that was a very big stutter and for what reason I didn't see anything spawn in whoa was it over here or was it it, it certainly wasn't that haunted house down there that was too far away Well, I don't know. That was weird. I guess sometimes that just happens, huh? I certainly don't see anything nearby. I mean, there's something way out there. Well, maybe not way out there, but far enough out there that it shouldn't have shouldn't have done that. Hmm. Okay. Now I got a cactus in here, so I got to deal with that too. Gotta watch out for them cactus, they'll kill you. <laughs> I see something else over there too. What is that? There are so many rocks that I can't even, like, take my eyes off the road for a second. Oh my god. And then the randomly the wheels just, like, lock up, which is always good fun when that happens. Yes, yeah, so we got ourselves a haunted house here, which are... Not the most fun places to explore. I'm kind of curious as to what this thing over here is. Um, let's just take a little detour over here and see what this is. And how far away is it, actually? Actually, it looks like another junkyard, doesn't it? Crap. All right. All right. Well, I guess we're stopping here. Uh, where'd it go? Oh, it's right there. Okay. <laughs> See, uh, are there any vehicles out there? Looks like there's something. Looks like there's a Barkus and a... Maybe a Volks... No. Hard to tell. Uh, ignition off. Hop out. Yeah, what do we got over here? Ah, oh, God, they ought to save. We've got... Oh, it's like Lada and a Barkus flatbed. Yeah, nothing that exciting. All right, well, maybe we'll explore that on the next next episode. Maybe we'll just skip it because that's what I usually do. <laughs> but anyways, I think I am going to end this one for now. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I really appreciate it. I appreciate all of the channel support 
things have been getting crazy and I'm loving it. Um, I never really thought that I would accomplish this much with this channel doing what I'm doing. So I really appreciate everybody's uh, support. Uh, follow along, uh, like and subscribe if you haven't done that. Um, maybe think about being a channel member and uh, I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care.